friends, it's me. Today, I wanted to share with you guys some neato TikToks that I found that made me go, whoa, I've never seen this before. So this is insane. So there's like this claw machine at the arcade and there are two mighty fine juicy iPhones, brand new. And he took a magnet and dragged it down into the hole. Two iPhones, free. <laughs> It's gotta be a very powerful magnet for him to just drag and drop. Smash like if you hear before the FBI. I thought kangaroos had a pouch, not a gaping hole in their flesh. What? So he opens it up and he's just chilling in there. Excuse me, sir. Are you sure that was the pouch? This ain't gonna get me demonetized, right? This is so confusing. This has gone against everything I've ever known about kangaroos my entire life. It's just a hole and apparently you can just pull it open. Excuse me, ma'am. Gotta make sure you're not smuggling any kangaroos in there. So I had no idea what laundry stripping was until I saw this TikTok. So you take borax, arm and hammer, tie, fill your bathtub with water, and then put your towels in. Those are clean towels, but look at the water. It's so mucky and disgusting. So you telling me this whole time the washing machine is not doing a good job, or I guess years and years of buildup and grime go in the towels. So apparently this works with white towels too. Like you put them in and it's supposed to be disgusting and you get that doo-doo water. So I wanna try this, cause I ain't trying to use no doo-doo towel. When you order something from McDonald's and then complain, this is what you get. Large fries, I got you. Thank you, have a nice day. Why are you giving okay, me fries like this? Oh, okay, I'll, I'll replace them. No, give them the same fries. What is this? Clearly doesn't look like the ad. Okay, you know what, let's give them the same fries. Just fluff them up a bit. You know, that's all the customer wants. Remember what Mr. Crab said? The customer is always wrong. Yeah, I just saw this girl on my For You page do like this. She like put her AirPod up to the camera and it like had lights, but look at this. Hold on. Too close. Do you see that? What is that? Is that real? It looks like UV rays. Or it could be the inside of Jimmy Neutron's brain. It's an explosion waiting to happen. Good thing I don't own AirPods. Everybody has that one thing in their house that everybody thinks is so cool. Could be a hidden cabinet, little movie room, gadget, but ours is this. Is that the Eiffel Tower? Are you in France? Do you live right next to the Eiffel Tower? This has got to be like a boathouse or something. It's like connected to a bridge. It's a restaurant. Does she live here? Your backyard is Paris. What? That's crazy. I bet that one room apartment, $10,000 a month. This is how a pharmacist makes pills. So I thought this was super interesting. So you take the powder, measure it, and then you pour it into the molds. Push them bad boys in, and then watch, 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 watch. Oh, and then it pops out, half blue, half white. That's how you do it. Fresh made pills. <laughs> nice. This is what I probably would have been doing if I wasn't doing YouTube. And you just want to really nicely get them with a karate chop. <gasps> Instantly turns white like that. You can see the colors are still moving a bit, but He's dead, straight like that. Just like that, that's how you do it. You ever have to take out an octopus? Just karate chopping that big ol' head. He out, cold. And he just like instantly like turns white. I mean, it's cool, I had no idea, but now I know. That, that's a weak spot, right between the eyes. So if you ever find yourself squared up against a squid, boom, Ooh. take him out real good. If you're wondering what a honeycomb looks like as they're taking it out, oh, he just cut that right out. Oh, nice. And then scoop up all the good stuff. Look at that bee, that poor bee. He was calling his homies. Hey, it started! Avalanche! Hello, friends! It's bee gun. Get it? Bee gun? <laughs> this is a Japanese restaurant and it's shaped like a boat. Also, you can fish in the restaurant for your food. And whatever you catch, you get to eat. This is so insanely cool. I want to go here one day. Oh, no! They made sashimi out of him. Oh, but it's so fancy. Wow. You would have thought the fishes that live there would have learned by now. Don't get caught. Don't go for the bait. Y'all ever wondered what happens when you take a fly, earn its trust, and then put it near a Venus flytrap? <laughs> Come on, get in there. Oh, it's just chilling. Ooh. Oh, when he gets out of there, he'll never trust you again. <laughs> oh, that crunch. Just so, mmm, so satisfying. I hate flies. May they all suffer. So there's this bridge in China. It's on a mountain. As you 
walk on it, it has screens that crack. And it's terrified some people. So as you're walking along it, it's gonna crack. Oh my gosh, this is so long. This is just a special effect. I mean, I don't know how safe I would feel walking across a glass bridge on the side of a mountain anyway. Imagine not knowing about this before you set foot on it. I mean, it's made of glass. I have a feeling it actually might crack one day. My mom's always saying, Lindsay, why do you shower in my shower so much? Oh, I don't know, Melissa. What? Why am I? This is the fanciest shower I've ever seen in my life. It's literally on an ocean. I traded in my privacy for this shower. Anyone who swims by is gonna see a little more than some fishies. So you know those nasty cracks on the road that make your car go Oof! Feels like running over a small animal. So this machine is supposed to repair the cracks. If it's so easy, why aren't y'all just like constantly repairing the cracks in the roads? It just goes over it and just like boom, seals it up. Too bad, we can't just walk into a Home Depot and get one of these bad boys. Just do it myself. Okay, I'm watching Gossip Girl and here is Serena standing up. She looks bright. Oh, there it is again. She looks good. But then, <laughs> she's wearing sweatpants. <laughs> Wait, so she gets up at the restaurant and she magically has sweatpants and a bag on. Where did that spawn from? I mean, it do be cold on set. Somebody forgot to crop this. Wow. How are so many people gonna watch this and not notice until now? Is what I wanna know. This is how they make jeans. Oh, whoa, Thanos just snapped and there was an imprint on the denim. Oh, we're gonna add distress. Where is this coming from? You see this? Is this much love and effort put into every pair of jeans? Whoa, and then there's a fire that cuts it. Okay, we, we haven't even sewed it yet. That was just step one. Dang, no wonder jeans so expensive. So apparently it's a trend on TikTok to make glasses out of utensils. Did they heat them up? How did they make glasses out of spoons? Oh, are they plastic? Okay, they'll do be looking fire though. Nice. 2020. Spoons aren't just for scooping. Make the kiddo think you bought him a Starbucks check. Got some Kool-Aid Neo. Ask for a water cup. Put some Kool-Aid. Give it to the child. Be like, I got you a tea. <laughs> Oh, they always fall for it. This is like the equivalent of giving your child a broken controller while you're actually playing. Look, Daddy, you're doing so good. But this is how they go up to have trust issues. Take a really close look at the coins in your house. Okay, I know we in quarantine, but I don't know if I'm that bored yet that I'm going to inspect every coin in my house. But apparently this dude found the 1970 spy coin. This could be what's called a covert coin or a spy coin. Some of these are still in circulation. This one's from 1977. If you find one of these, get a ring like this, one that it'll sort of fit inside without falling through. Maybe try your mom or dad's wedding ring. You still just conveniently had a ring that fit perfectly. On a quarter. None of my fingers ain't even close to the circumference of a quarter. But go on. And then bang it against a hard surface. Sometimes it takes a couple hits. And that'll like dislodge. What the heck? What is that? Is that a micro SD card or a SIM card? In a coin. Those weren't even around in the 70s. Unless the government was keeping them a secret from us. But I mean, I didn't know you could hide things in quarters. I don't know the top just came off. Bada bing, bada boom. George Washington took his hat off. This is how they make fries. They put them through the, oh no, it got jammed. Into the French Fryer 3000. And then you just pull the lever. Wham, bam, fresh fries, ma'am. Who got the best fries? Comment below. Is this even a question? In and out. I've never had five guys before though. My husband has been keeping a secret from me. He says that the right way to brush your teeth is to first rinse with an alcohol mouthwash, then to floss, then to brush your teeth, and then to use a fluoride rinse. He says if you do the alcohol mouthwash last, it'll remove the fluoride that you just put on your teeth by brushing them, so you should do it first to kill the germ, and then finish off with a whitening fluoride rinse. Apparently the last time that he went to the dentist, the hygienist told him that he didn't even really need a cleaning. I don't know how accurate this is, but when I wash 
washed it. I tried it. Okay, I, I didn't use all of these steps because ain't nobody got time for that. I used mouthwash. I brushed my teeth and then I used mouthwash again and then my teeth felt so clean. And I went to sleep and I woke up and they still felt clean, which is weird because that never happens. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below. Let me know what you learned today. And if you learned anything new, make sure to hit that like button in the face. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click. Click. And subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh! I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.